right, so we're shipwrecked. Bottom of the ocean. I don't know what to do. I haven't clicked on anything yet. Oh, Lola. Looks like I let you down again. Oh, Lola. Looks like I let you down. So we got Gladys. What's up, dude? Not blue yet. Oh yeah, that's you right. all right? I'm a spirit time. of the land, Manny. Not of the sea. Hang in there, Mano. What do we got here? According to our map, I think that's the pearl. Okay, well, I think we need to get to the pearl. We got a pizza ready in about 20 seconds. Oh, Lola. Looks like I let you down again. I'm trying to shut some stuff off here on my computer. Alright, so... Looks like we... Okay, can we walk anywhere? Oh, you can't walk out of the light? There's my little alarm clock. Let's go see how well the pizza, the pizza's all nice and done yet here. Yeah, you can't even walk out of the day. Okay, well, I think we need to go see what that guy is that's walking around, but let me go check something on my pizza real quick. I'll be right back. Yeah, pizza party. All right. Let's see what we can do here. Okay, this guy's walking around with a little light on his head. Little turtle or something. Little bottom of the sea creature. I don't know what the heck he's doing. He's just walking around. I think we need to probably talk to him. <clears throat> so maybe when he walks around, we'll take a look. Oh, he's way back there. According to our map, I think that's the pearl. Oh, whoops. Didn't click on the guy. Clicked on the pearl. Oh, maybe I have something in my inventory. I suppose I should check that real quick. What's up, Dredge? What's up, buddy? Working? I'll be working soon. Alright. 
Yeah, we're gonna wait for... Now, didn't he just walk from that side of the screen already? He's tricking me. I don't have any inventory. I just have the scythe. Hopefully we'll... Figure something out here with this guy. Holy smokes, man. He's way back there. Can I click on him now? Oh, you can't. Can I not even interact? Maybe when he walks up here, I can interact with him. Let's see. Let's see what we end up seeing here. Um... So pull up my Twitch chat channel here on the side. A little Twitch chat box. See it a little bit better now. Oh, here we go. Let's talk to him. Let's talk. Come here. Hey, 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 hey. Why, why is it going away? Equally, he looks like he's been down here a long time. Okay. Well, we could talk to him, but I, like, I'd click on him and then the icons would go away. So, I don't know. I'll have to click on him and try and talk to him next time he walks by. My friend talked me into getting this frozen pizza. And he's like, oh yeah, this is like a good brand. And it's like all thin. And this thing is like falling apart everywhere. Like, it's impossible to eat. Not literally impossible, as I take a big bite. <laughs> Dramatic. All right, so he walked from the left to the right. He was in the foreground. I tried to click on him and look at him. Didn't work very well. So now. There we go. Left. Amigo. Oh. There we go. Huh? Who? Oh, geez, another shipwreck. You see? That's why I never travel by boat. <laughs> oh. We've had a little accident. Think you could help us out? Depends on. To the pearl. Ha! You don't believe those old stories, do you? You think somewhere in this ocean there's a gigantic pearl that shines so brightly it can be seen from passing ships? And that sometimes sailors so allured by its luster actually fling themselves overboard to dive for it and are never heard from again? Yeah, and I think it's right over... Bah! I've been walking this ocean for years. I ain't <laughs> never seen it. <laughs> No, really. The pearl is right over there. You poor sucker. That's the moon. Tell me you didn't come all this way out here to pearl dive the moon. <laughs> the moon? Could we borrow that light for a second? Sorry. I'm kind of attached to it. <laughs> Could we tag along with you? Well, it's a long walk you're talking about. We don't have any other choice. Oh, all right then. Lift those knees, stick close to my light, and try to sing in key. This little light of mine, I'm gonna let it shine. This little light of mine, I'm gonna let it shine. This little light of mine, I'm gonna let it shine. Let it shine, let it shine, let it shine. Hide it under some seaweed, no. I'm gonna let it shine. Hide it under some seaweed, no. I'm gonna let it shine. Hide it under some seaweed, no. I'm gonna let it shine. Let it shine, let it shine, let it shine. Scare away sea monsters, yeah. 
gonna let it shine. Scare away sea monsters. 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 Scare this is a long walk. Well, now I gotta stop clicking over there. I thought that looked like our ship. That's just a trick the ocean plays on your mind, kid. Makes everything look the same after a while, like he was going in circles. <laughs> well, this isn't the kind of progress I was hoping for. Oh, well, the wet march of the soul ain't for everybody. Is everything okay with your eyebrows? Them is barnacles, genius. I don't move fast enough to shake them, so they tend to pile up. I don't mind, though. They're the only company I got. <laughs> Ain't you boys? Okay. What are you doing like down here? To Trying to get out of the land of the dead, same as everybody else. Why are you walking instead of taking a ship? Got sick of waiting around Rubicava for a boat. Figured I'd make better time this way. Why didn't I think of that? How do you know where you're going? See the moon over there? I just keep it on my right. That way I know I'm heading in a straight line. But oldest trick in the book. Keep it on my right, or you're walking in a circle. Flat Earth. Shouldn't you have hit dry land by now? I'm trying to cross a big ocean here, Sonny. What do you know about it? I've already done it. In a boat. A boat? Don't talk to me about boats. <coughs> What's the problem with boats? It's a long we conversation. Such a nice boat. Why is everybody always talking about boats? You got a perfectly good pair of legs. Why not use them, I say? Let me guess. You died in a boat wreck. A boat wreck would have been better than what happened to us. Led off course by bad equipment, lost for weeks, no food, no shelter from the sun. We'd started throwing the dead overboard. But then the sharks began following the boat. What happened in the end? What happened was I learned three valuable lessons. Stay away from boats. When it comes to navigation, trust only the moon and the stars. And when there's only two of you left, Never, ever go to sleep. Where'd you get the coral? Edge of the world, boy. That's the only place it grows. Could you send for help? Oh, sure. I promise to call for help at the next <laughs> phone booth I walk by. Oh, jerk. How long have you been down here? Well, let me put it this way. I wasn't always this color. How have you kept that light going all these years? Well, I found this coral, this oh, glow-in-the-dark oh, coral. Damnedest thing. Glows like a lightning bug and never seems to wear out. I had some of that once. Made a nice grappling hook. I don't yeah. think you had what I got, because I don't think you've been to the place where I got it. Well... I don't want to break your stride there. Okay, see you around. Watch out for sea monsters. Who? These guys? <laughs> oh, they don't mess with old Chipito. I'm too bright for them. <laughs> <laughs> this awesome. little light oh, of mine, I'm gonna let it shine. This little light of mine. Hey, lay off. <laughs> <clears throat> what am I supposed to do with this? Follow me. Where are you taking me? To the moon. <laughs> I love it. Oh, that's awesome. We just pick him up. Benny, <laughs> is that the pearl? Ooh I knew I'd find 
spider someday. I'm rich, 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 <clears throat> rich, rich. Shh, something's happening. Benny, what's going on? Has a storage container. <laughs> uh oh, I didn't mean to click on that. Okay, well, it looks like we can walk over there to the pearls that we're supposed to do, anyways. And I feel like that's I'm supposed not to be. So there really is a pearl. But does that mean Meche really jumped overboard here? It all just seems so fishy. fishy. <laughs> Good one, Captain. Okay, so we can't click on anything over here. Looks like we can go up I'm here. I'm not going down there the while that monster's looking right at me. Oh, well, maybe not. Oh, well, the monster is following. It is looking at us. Not quite as famous as the pearl is the slimy barnacle covered <laughs> old rock of legend. <laughs> uh, I don't want to get tangled up in those. Uh, What? Hey, lay off! Ah! Lego! Lego! Hey, Lego! You can't leave me here all alone! Uh oh, what the Come heck? Back here! She's coming back. Well, ah. oh, the it's like the Looks octopus like ship. South, Looks like a squid. There's nothing on that edge of the world except the edge. Well, this looks cool. Carnal, cause I don't know. I don't know if this pizza's worth eating. The rest of. I wonder if there's a Discord app for your phone. Cause maybe I could get in and I could chat there. There it is. But ding! Got this small streamer community that I'm trying to hang out in. But I've got it on my computer here on another screen. But then every time I click it, it goes to the We'll Be Right Back screen. Even though I can still see Grim Fandango on the screen here. So just losing focus, which is over. So, all right, can we leave? Nothing but dark water is that direction. What all do we have? We got a light. Another light. Can't. Okay, we can go over that way. Let's talk to Gladys. What's up, buddy? Getting a little blue around the edges. He's having a hard time breathing. I'm gonna just log into my Discord here, hopefully. There we go. Um, oh, whoops. Oh, okay. Okay, um, let me just shut off my, well, shit, I guess we can stay there anyways, but, uh, okay, so, 
Let's talk to Gladys. See any hint of that octopus swimming around here? No, but I can smell him. <laughs> you can smell that octopus. Let's see what's over here real quick. I don't know what I'm looking at. I feel like I'm underwater. How convenient. What does it do? It'll change the flow of whatever that is. But we don't know if we want to do that yet. Because I don't know what it is we're flowing. It looks like just sludge. Gladys, I'm going to sneak inside and look for Mechi. What if that octopus comes back while you're gone? Poke him in the eye and steal his sub. <laughs> Stupid octopus. Looks like a hidden panel or doorway of some kind, but apparently not right now. Okay. It's empty. Garbage bin. Chair. Man, that ashtray is so fancy you could eat caviar out of it. Huh? Is it an ashtray that's on the side of a chair? Children's books. Locked. Mm, I'm kind of confused. Meche. Okay, here's somebody. Manny, what oh, are you doing here? That's the girl we've been I looking for. I wanted to see how your trip was going, Angel. I am your travel agent, you know. By the way, thanks for that bottle of champagne you sent me. It really hit the spot. You were headed for a trap. I was trying to warn you. Domino was using me like bait. I didn't want you to end up a prisoner here like me. Prisoner? Where's your cell? Or are you just sharing a bunk with the warden? Dang! If give him a slap. If that's think of me, then why did you come here? Because this is where he belongs. Here, working for me. I knew you'd come around eventually. Right or wrong, Manuel Calavera is always with the winning team, right Manny? That's why you're here uh, now. I'm getting off this rock, and I'm taking all of these people with me. <laughs> Manny, there's no way off this island. I'm afraid you're stuck here in my little executive training program. See, I need you to take my place here, kid. I've got to get back to the city where the action is. Sorry, Manny, but I had to come in. My skin was getting all pruney. Him, I don't need. What? I'm gonna grind you to powder for that, cabron. Maybe later. But for now, let me just show you your new office. Oh yeah, he is a boxer. <laughs> Careful, BB. The new boss is waking up. I'm not a boss. I don't want to be the boss. I like my old desk better. Oh, God. What do we have here? This is sad. Really, really sad. Hola, angelitos. I'll bite you, I swear to God. Please don't bite anyone else, Pugsy. That's why they put us in the cage in the first place. Why do you want to bite me? You're the mean new boss. Mr. Hurley said you were meaner than him. He said you had a bone saw. I 
see your parents. Let's My name is them. Manny Calavera. What's yours? Mr. Hurley told us about you. You're the one who tricked Meche. Poor Meche. Mech is my friend. You can ask her. She talked about you before. Every time she says your name, she looks so sad. I don't know what you did to her, but you're gonna be sorry! What are you two doing in this cage? Making light bulbs. Look, we're working as hard as we can. Why don't you leave us alone? Listen, children. I'm here to help. There's really not much more room in here. Your hands are too big to make light bulbs. Is that what we're making? I'm here to help you get out of this cage. You can't do that. We have to stay here and take care of Mitchett. She'd be so sad here all alone. Sometimes we hear her crying, you know. My hands are not too big to make light bulbs. Then why don't you help? I'm in the maritime <sighs> unit. We can't do factory work. I don't know what those words mean. It means he doesn't want to help us because he's mean. I love it. My butt's too big to sit on one of those little perches. Um, I'm gonna tell Mecha you said that word to us. I told you he was bad. I just don't have any of those little tiny tools, that's all. Here, take my hammer. <laughs> <laughs> you bite me and I'll sue your parents. Our parents? Our parents? Mr. Hurley said he was supposed to take care of Meche, but you stole her case from him. Is that true? That voice actor sounds familiar. I'm the one who's gonna take Meche out of here. What? You can't do that. Who's gonna take care of us? We'll be all alone. <laughs> <laughs> up with this knife, but let's have two little like dead angel kids making white boys in a cage. Like, I'm here to help you get out of this cage. You can't do that. We have. She'd be. Sometimes I already said that. Let me see. You see, I had this job selling travel packages to immigrant souls. If I sold enough of them. I got to leave the land of the dead. Now, I was in a slump, and I really needed a fat commission, so... You're a bad man. Go away, bad man! Yeah, go away! Nice cage you have here. Mr. Hurley grew demon ravens with human heads in here. He said if we ever tried to get away, he'd send the ravens after us. And let them make nests out of our bones. Okay, back to work. So mean. Uh, I didn't want to say that they're mean children and they deserve to be in a cage, so. Okay, that was the door that was locked earlier. So now let's go back over here and see if we can go talk to Meche. Oh, hi. Oh, look, it's my Prince Charming. Are you back here just to insult me some more, or do you just want some ice for your head? I like the new dress. Well, it's the best I could pull together out here. Do you have any idea how hard it is to get decent fabric and silk stockings on a deserted factory island on the edge of the world? Hmm. No. No, I don't. Come on. We're getting out of here. Trying to steal my commission from Domino again. Manny, don't you ever give up? I'm not after any commission. I just want to get us both out of here. Then why don't you just ask your boss for the day off?
can't believe you think he's my boss. He's my arch enemy. I think he's your boss. You think he's my boyfriend. We don't seem to have a good foundation of trust in our relationship, do we? I'm sorry I implied he was your boyfriend. I do trust you. Well, I'm not sure I trust you about that. But I'll tell you one thing that would convince me. Name it. Give me your gun. What? What makes you think I have a gun? You work for the most heavily armed organization in the land of the dead. Uh -huh. Don't try to tell me they didn't issue you a gun. They didn't issue me a gun. What, are you on probation? I'm not buying this, Manuel. Manny, why don't you come back when you're willing to deal what straight with me, okay? What part of the game did I miss that says that I have a gun? Hey, about that. Ready to have... I would if... I right. I don't work for the most heavily armed organization anywhere. You know, you're right. There are those rumors of that revolutionary army that's been stockpiling weapons. Actually, them, I work for. Manny... Why don't you come back when you're willing to... <laughs> Man, that ashtray so fancy. Once you got used to the sooty aftertaste, you'd feel like a king. What's with the ashtray? Can I... Can I smoke in it? <gasps> Ow! What? Oh, my stockings! They're ruined! <laughs> and this was my best hair! <laughs> oh, you, you try to have one nice thing on this cruel island. Go get some stockings. <sighs> I think we should go get the stockings. Good enough for me. What is? Oh, uh, the um, the speed at which you're working. That's nice, Manny, but you're not my boss, so really I couldn't care less. Good, excellent. Carry on. Did we have a gun back in my office? In my desk? She seems to think I have a gun. Does she think I have a gun because of those guys? Or does she think I have a gun? Oh, ooh, can I get a piece of whatever that was? What the heck? What is that? This is the tiniest little hammer I've ever you seen. I could make a tiny little birdhouse if I had some tiny little nails and wood. I don't really want to do that. Okay, we'll put it away. I don't know what the heck the tiny hammer's for. No drawers. Oh. Well, I like I my old desk better. Okay, Not so... Not moving any furniture today. Maybe I don't have a gun. Can, can I go tell these kids that I'm cool with Mitchell now? Hola, Angelitos. Hello, Mr. Mean Boss Guy. <laughs> hey, would one of you children happen to have a gun? Yeah, we do. So stick him up. Let me see it. He doesn't have one. He's such a liar. Oh, yeah? Well, you're stupid. Your light bulbs don't work. Your light bulbs all smell like boogers. <laughs> ha! Nobody thinks you're funny anymore. <laughs> oh, yeah? Well, everybody in this cage is smarter than you. Everybody except for you. Yeah, because I'm especially smarter than you. In your dreams. In your baby bed that's all wet, could you wet in it? Shut up! Bed wetter! I said shut up! No, no, really. I have to sleep with an umbrella down here. Oh, <laughs> yeah? Well, at least I never asked Meche to marry me. What? Miss Colomar, you're so pretty. Will you marry me? I never said that! Ooh, Miss Colomar! Stupid baby blue beanie bed wetter! The Bugsy lies like a Rugsy. Will you two just shut up?
Hey, hey, don't cry, children. Please, stop crying. Why am I so bad at this? You're too bad, little children. I'm glad you're in a cage. Very bad. You children just wait here and be brave little angelitos, okay? Okay. That shut him up at least. Okay, well, okay, so he, we were able to ask him about a gun, so I was kind of maybe on the right track by coming and asking him about the gun, but I'm not really sure what's going on here. Hey, about that you? gun. Ready to hand over your heater? I would if I had one. Right. I think we need to talk. Start talking. You're the salesman. I have a lot of explaining to do. Save your breath. Domino's explained it all to me already. I'm gonna pull up this guy's... Uh... Oh, okay. Looks like this guy is doing some... Have a lot of explaining to do. Me? About what? Uh, I think I'm pretty confused as far as what's going on with Meche right here. Why did you take me out with that champagne bottle? I told you to stop you from falling into Domino's trap. If you had made it on that ship, then you would have ended up here. Yes. Why are you working for Domino? I do what he asks only to protect the children. Why are those children locked up in a cage? With the wings those angelitos have, they're the only things on this island Domino can't control. Hey, if they can fly, let's set the kids free to go get help. They can't fly that far, Manny. But they can fly circles around Domino, and they can bite pretty hard. <laughs> <laughs> So why did you run out of my office? I felt so embarrassed, and you looked so disappointed in me. I couldn't stand it anymore. Then what were you doing that whole year I was in Ubakawa? I was lost. What did you... I don't want to talk about that year, please. Has Domino hurt you in any way? Not as much as I've hurt him. Boy, can that guy take a punch. Okay, I'll lay off the questions. Great. Now if we could get you to just lay off the cologne. Hey, I'm a sailor now. We have to wear this stuff. Listen, Mechi. Manny, talking isn't helping right now, okay? Hey, about ready to. I would. Right. Listen, Manny, talking isn't helping right now, okay? Okay, so we need a gun. Still Sir, do you have an opinion? I don't think you fully understand the chain of command. Pugsy and BB work for you. You and I work for Domino, who works for Hector Le Mans, crime boss of El Maro. Well, I think it's time for a little corporate restructuring. Dude, he can't hear me. If he's got headphones on, are we supposed to hit him with the hammer? 
He seems completely unaware of how close I am to escape. You know we have to try and hit him with the hammer. What the heck is that? Oh, that's her stuff. You know, a little clear nail polish would fix these right up. <laughs> this is the tiniest little hammer I've ever seen. Should we hit him with it? Please put that. That. <laughs> okay, you can take out the tiny hammer if you want. No, I don't think I could take it. I don't really want to do that. What? Domino. Domino! Taking your first coffee break already, Calavera? We got a score to settle, Issy. You know, if Let's I see. ever spoke to my boss, Hector, that way... You killed my best friend. The demon? <sighs> Manny, you can use a demon as a driver. Let him carry your messages, let him serve you food. But you can't ever start thinking of them as friends. It's just not natural. doing out here on the edge of the world oh I know I ask myself that every day but I'm going to train you Manny to take my place here running this two-bit light bulb factory how can you keep little children in a cage trust me it's easier than keeping big kids in a cage why don't you just sprout me like you tried to put a sapato that wasn't me that was Hector. He's so unimaginative. Just wants to tie up the loose ends, you know? But I believe, however, that you can be rehabilitated through honest work. What makes you think I'm gonna work for you? Well, there's not much to do on this island if you don't work, take it for me. And think about it. Once I'm gone, it will be just you and Meche alone on this deserted island. Don't tell me that prospect doesn't appeal to you. I don't plan to be on this island for very long. Manny, I have all the guns, I have all the transportation, and I have all the brains. What are you gonna do? I think we need to get a gun from him. You and Hector set up a secret hideout to make light bulbs? Oh, no, that's just a side benefit. The real purpose is to have a place we can lock up all those old clients of mine. Can't have good people wandering loose in the land of the dead telling everybody how we stole their double-in tickets, now can we? You stole all these people's tickets? Okay, how much of this haven't you figured out, Calavera? Kapal would route all the good clients to me after he switched over their tickets to a secret holding fund. I'd cover up the paper trail, and we'd make sure that the pigeon jumped overboard <laughs> at the Pearl. I knew it! You were getting all the good clients. I handled them all, except for Mercedes, who you hijacked for me in that ridiculous hot rod, which I saw, by the way, last time I was in Rubicava. I tell you, Manny, hot rods like that just don't look safe to me. So it wasn't my fault Mechie didn't get a ticket. You stole it. Well, it's your fault she ended up in the forest instead of coming here right away, but I fixed that. I'm taking Meche out of this dungeon. Manny, before I found her, she spent a year out there in a petrified forest alone because of you. By comparison, I'd say I'm keeping her pretty comfortable here in my, uh, dungeon. Wouldn't you say? Dungeon. One ticket for you, one for Hector. How many more do you need? Oh, Manny. We never touch the product ourselves. We sell a ticket to unfortunate souls, unable to lead moral lives because of the crippling amount of cash they were born into. But you could just take the tickets and leave today. We found a way to make the land of the dead livable. Why would we want to leave? 
Nice island you got here. Yeah, the previous owners didn't know what they had here. Let us pick it up for a song. They scooped out all the coral they could reach with their crane and then abandoned the plant. But we knew we had what it would take to go the extra distance to the big reef. Are you about to lecture me about the winning attitude no again? No, <laughs> slave labor, Manny. That's the real ticket to success. Well, I gotta get back to trying to escape. <laughs> hey, you do that, kid. Knock yourself out. All right. Well, maybe we need to go back outside and switch that sludge. The direction that that trolley was going or something. Kind of sad that Gladys is gone. I bet you we find him. Anyway. Oh, we can go this way too. So maybe we'll do that. We'll see if this is okay. It's not different. So I still don't know what that is, but it looks like we can go over here. I don't think I saw that before. Let's go see what he's got going on for us. Why I oughta. Oh, that's the guy Freak from earlier. Him. Freak him. Ooh, to the moon, he says. Stupid chisel. Hold still. I'll show him. Chilling, chilling. Lay down your tools. Chilling, We're busting chilling. out of here. Man, if I had only gotten that book back from Terry, I could really start some trouble here. Why, I oughta. Chapito seems a little overpowered by his trick. Chapito! Huh? Who? Oh, you, is it? Why, I oughta. Look at my eyebrows. Well, you really weren't standing in a very safe place. Well, neither are you right now, Oh, um, go. Relax, we're busting out of here soon. We? We are done traveling together. I work solo, my friend, and I walk alone. Nice drill. Drill? This here is a cordless high-speed reciprocating chisel. Oh, wow. And look, it's a bust all. They usually don't give these to the new guys. How'd you get a bust all? I'm connected, plugged in, and I had some booty to trade. Trade's the name of the game out here in the Big Reef. Booty? Where'd you get booty? It's all over the ocean floor. Jewelry, precious coins. You people and your fancy boats never know about it, because you just never stop and look. Give me some booty, and I'll buy our way out of here. I traded it all for this beauty. You traded jewelry and precious coins for a power tool? It's a bust all. I want to trade something. Well, you came to the right place, Sonny. What you be needing? A gun. Ooh, that's gonna cost some. What do you got on you? I think it's some form of blue-green algae. Ah, oh, don't worry, you get used to it. When you got something worth you do. Chapito! Huh? What? That took Oh, nothing. If you say so. Well, I gotta please bust away. Chapito, huh? What? Well, please hold still. Weird. So we need to get something to trade. I don't know how I get down there without this current taking me over the edge. Oh. Well, now. Uh oh. Is it gonna put me in the track and make me go the whole way down? Oh no, I'm super confused. Oh. Oh. What in the world? Oh, hey! 
they bought us. Yeah, see, we didn't lose him. Gladys! You're okay. Well, it hurt a little when I hit, but my head cracked open an aft panel here. I gotta tell you, Carnal, I thought you were dead. Oh, Manny, I've been having a great time. Listen. I ask you, is there an engine that can resist the love that's in these hands? Apparently not. I think this babe... Oh, yeah, good point. I was just wrenching it for fun, but your idea is good, too. <laughs> All right, so we need to get out of here, apparently. <laughs> I'm so confused. Is it, is it my? Oh. Okay, well, I'm confused here. You know, a little clear nail polish would fix these right up. Okay, well, maybe I need to give him the hammer or the stockings. Maybe I need to give him the items. Because it looked like I was able to do some... Do it through chatting, but maybe not. Maybe I need to just... Stupid chisel! Try and handle this stuff. Why I oughta... Freaking freaking... Why I oughta... Hey, Chappy, check out the hosiery. Say, these are real silk. Where'd you find them? I've been wearing them the whole time. You too? Well then, here's your new best friend. Ah, my what? first Sproutella gun. Is it loaded? No. Hey, bullets are hard to get. Rickin' frickin'. Rickin' frickin'. What else can I try? Can I trade in the hammer? Yo, Pedo! Have you ever seen an authentic little chipper? A little chipper? No, I haven't. But I'd sure love to give it a test drive. Say, little chipper, you're okay. Did I just get a gun oh, and a bus dog? Virginia! I probably can't trade him the da -de -da -de -da -da. It's a bus doll. But um my but scythe. Um. I like to keep it next to where my Ah, my first Sproutella gun. It's a bus doll. Okay, well now that we have a gun, now we can go give a gun to La -de -da -de -da -da -da. Apparently. Apparently that's the goal here. Got just a few more minutes here before I gotta head to work, so we're gonna try and crack off the hour. That's always my goal is to try to get a full hour in. Um Okay, let's, let's give her my gun. Oh yeah, wrong place. Office is over here. Let's give her the gun. Here, what good's a relationship without trust? True. A relationship without trust is about as empty as a gun without bullets. Guess you didn't realize a smart girl always keeps an extra round in her hat for mad days. Come on, let's go. Mitchy, you don't know what you... I know exactly what I'm doing. Now move! Would you just listen to my escape plan first? Trouble in paradise, kids. You're letting us go right now, or your boy Friday here gets it. Well, I hate to see you go, Manny, but, uh... The lady seems to have made up her mind. I'm serious. I'll shoot him. Fine. He really doesn't work for me anyway. But I thought he... 
I'll shoot you then. No, you won't. You're too good, remember? I'm not. I'm not good anymore. You've taken that out of me, keeping me a prisoner here. I'm gonna crack you open like a fake wing bar. I'm gonna... <sighs> Kid's all right. <laughs> She's a firecracker. But a night in the cooler usually dampens her fumes. What? That's it? Domino! Hey, Sport, how's the uh, escape going? What did you do with her? I thought she needed a little uh, time out, that's all. Well, I gotta get back to trying to escape. <laughs> hey, you do that, kid. Knock yourself out. Okay, well, I don't know. I'm warning you, Domino! Oh, see? This is this this is different now. I'm getting angry! There was a door here. Must this be a combination lock, but there are no numbers on it. This isn't funny! It's me, Meche! I guess I didn't I'm enter the right angry. combination. Okay, so we have to figure out the right combination. Well, we could go. I want to know what the conveyor, what that lever does. It looks like it takes. I don't understand what it is. Can you walk up here? Oh! Oh, what the hell? Okay. I still don't understand what all this is. Like, what are they? They're mining... Did they say it earlier? Coral? Yeah, there's nothing to click on here. Some, some big building. Apparently. Oh, shit. Oh, okay. Oh, so we're over here. Oh, jeez. Okay. So it was a crane. We can go from that side. And then we can come over this side. But let's stop here. Oh, hey. Alright, let's go. Let's go like just right in the middle and see if we can exit. I can't get out of here. Oh. There's no ladder. Okay. So there's a ladder all the way over here then. Oh, yeah, okay. So we can throw some shit in there apparently. going on here they must bring the core over here to be crushed either that or these are the biggest meanest looking hair curlers I've ever seen oh you can go down here oh okay I don't really like that. Like, if you want to go look at something, it seems like it takes forever to walk there. Let's just go look at it. It's the edge of the world, but not the edge I'm looking for. Ooh, okay. Okay, well. Oh, we looked at not the rock, we were just looking at the edge, okay. Well, it, you drop the coral in there from the crane. So, should we drop the crane? Oh. That's not what I thought it was going to get. I thought it was going to drop in there. Okay, well, let's go see what the hell the end of this thing does. I'm 
room down here. Okay. Oh, you can go over here? What's over here? Oh, shit. Hold on to nothing, apparently. Did you walk out there? Is anything happen? No. All right, well, I just hit my hour, so I'm going to go ahead to work. Um, but it looks like I've dropped this... The crane deal on the side for some reason, whatever. I don't know what to do with this. Um, but maybe next time we can go take a look at it and see what we need to do. This coop looks heavier than my last ship. Mm. It's not a handheld device. It's not a handheld yeah. device. I don't know what we're supposed My scythe. I like to keep it next to where my heart used to be. It. I don't want to mess up my blade. Sure, what they want us to do with that, but uh, either way, yeah. Uh, thanks for watching. We'll check it. Uh, we'll check in next time. We'll go a little bit further. Keep trying to crank out. I want to get rid of. I want to finish Grim Fandango uh, because I think it's the game that I am currently in the middle of that I have the least amount of hours left to finish. Um, kind of want to wrap that up. Then I want to wrap, wrap up uh, Final Fantasy 13 3 as well as Fallout 4. Fallout 4, I probably still have like another 20 hours in. So if I can get some maybe some big streams in next week, maybe I can rip through it and finish it off. Maybe Final Fantasy I can dig into, and then I'll hopefully next week I've got the week off. And hopefully next week I can get fall wrap up Grim Fandango this week, wrap up Fallout next week, get another game added to the list that I'm currently playing. I like to play two or three at a time, um, kind of keep moving. So, anyways, thanks for watching. We'll catch you guys next time. <clears throat> Have a good one.